Good day everyone. My name is Associate Professor Mary Caroline M. Castaño and I am from the College of Commerce and Business Administration and the Graduate School, University of Santo Tomas, Manila, Philippines. My topic is benchmarking the best practices of Asian universities in increasing student mobility. Student mobility is a strategic way of enhancing the student's appreciation and understanding of different cultures, languages, origins, and learning approaches by giving a chance to all local students to engage with career opportunities around the world. It is commonly described to be a collaborative result of a student's degree program provided by a partner institution. With the rise of globalization, institutions of higher education need to become more international in order to operate effectively in the global market. It is basically a part of the academe wherein students get to experience working or studying through international flight and travel, whether undergraduate or postgraduate. Globalization had brought significant changes to the ways students perceive higher education. Influenced by the importance of higher levels of education, students are now keen on finding education that would best serve their purpose or intention. With the rise of globalization, institutions of higher education need to become more international in order to operate effectively in the global market. Objectives of the study. First, to know which factors affect the choice of foreign students in selecting the university. Second, to identify the particular factors that foreign students consider to be important in choosing their current university. Third, to determine the macro-environmental factors that influence the foreign student's choice of function. The paper is descriptive research and utilizes published international student-related journals. The researcher developed the questionnaire after reviewing several journals, and the researcher was the questionnaire was subjected to a reliability test using Cronbach Alpha and yielded a reliability of 0.73. The respondents of the study were from, were from different higher education institutions in the Philippines. The survey yielded a total of 178 respondents representing various countries across six continents worldwide. About 45.55% of them came from major universities in Manila. The questionnaire was administered to different universities in the Philippines to determine the following. The demographic profile of the international students, their preferences, the factors that they consider in selecting a university. Results and discussion. Table 1 shows the factors affecting foreign students' choice of the university. Most foreign student participants cited the social and economic, academic reputation of the university or college as a significantly influence, influential factor affecting their choice of university with a mean score of 5.06. The availability of the desired program with a mean score of 4.99, course content with a mean score of 4.68, are also significantly influential factors in the choice of the university. The link between the university and the possible employers with a mean score of 3.61 are influential in their choice of the university. Particular factors considered to be important when choosing a current university most foreign student participants cited quality of education, 
and academic reputation of the university as significantly important factors considered in the choice of their current university with a mean score of 5.35. Likewise, the programs offered with a mean score of 4.98 and job opportunities after graduation with a mean score of 4.70 are significantly important in the choice of their current university. Based on the result, economic factors are very important in selecting the choice of a university in a particular country with a mean score of 3.71, the current economic state of the country, which includes the cost of living, taxes, labor costs, are considered to be very important. Other factors such as environmental, sociocultural, political, legal, and technological factors are considered to be important. More than half or 56% of the respondents came from commerce and business administration and postgraduate programs, masters and doctorate. Other respondents were enrolled in arts and letters, humanities, medicine and surgery, education, tourism and hospitality, nursing and science. 66% of the respondents stated that the availability of their desired program significantly influences their choice of university. Respondent from Bangladesh, Ghana, Hong Kong, Kenya, Papua New Guinea, and Saudi Arabia stated that having a large campus and numerous student amenities are most important for their selection of their desired university. 79% of the total respondents stated that economic circumstances were important to most important factors that influenced their choice of a country. Foreign students consider the social and academic reputation of the university as the most influential factor affecting their choice of university. The study of Boyasi and Oz stated academic motives as one of the factors for the intent of international students to go abroad. Students emphasize having the prestige of the foreign diploma. This finding is also consistent with those of the studies that determine the academic reputation of the university as one of the most important factors in selecting universities. Different studies by Tan, Chai, Trang, Kobori in 2017 were in contrast with the findings of this research, wherein they specified that participants were not motivated by selectivity, quality, and rank of an institution, but rather mostly with the family and friends recommendation. With the advent of globalization, academic boundaries will be minimized and eventually eliminated. By focusing more on extensive and groundbreaking research, Asian universities may be able to attract more students and faculty. This will give way to the enhancement of international education and individual opportunities. The exchanges in the future may seem costly at first, but these top universities also had the same problems and issues until improvements have been achieved. Widening and strengthening partnerships with other universities and organizations would be vital as these partnerships enable students in the university to learn through exchange programs or ex externship, thereby gaining international exposure in the process. Asian universities must also invest aggressively in the digital landscape to be competitive both locally and globally. The devastating effect of coronavirus is beyond question and higher education is the exemption. Normally, the education industry acts with precision to improve its facilities in order to attract foreign students with the aim of improving its resources. Today, the pandemic has effectively altered the norms of the industry and completely changed the landscape of higher education. School-related activities are temporarily suspended and online activities became the new norm. 
hands, the school authorities scramble in search of appropriate measures to adapt to the new normal. This, the move is aimed to minimize a gap between previous activities and the new normal with the goal of, in, of aiding the students to obtain the knowledge that they deserve. It is therefore a challenge to other researchers who wish to pursue further this study in order to determine the factors to be considered a tone with the pandemic. So these are my references. So thank you very much for listening. Have a great day ahead.